Welcome to my channel, Senior Citizen Sioux Cooking. If you're looking for my other channels, they will be down below in the description box. It's hiking, gardening, and some clothing and unboxing. Okay, what you will need is two boneless, skinless chicken breasts or enough to equal one pound. Of course, of a uh, slow cooker. Mustard, uh, soy sauce, or tamari sauce. Soy sauce works. Red pepper, pineapple, paprika, turmeric, regular pepper, and green pepper. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'll get my sauce ready, so I'll bring you down here. I'm going to chop up my uh, green pepper, and my oven is still not working. I'm going to schedule a repairman at some point, but for now, since it's summertime, I don't anticipate using my oven a lot and if I do I'll use my toaster oven today it is already let me see 86 degrees out and it's oh 11 in the morning so it's only gonna going to get hotter so crock pot meals work out best okay so get this all chopped up here and I'll, uh, you know, film the progress on, on my uh, chicken, how it's going. It needs to cook for, uh, on low, for six to eight hours, or on high for four to, four to six. I'm going to cook it on low. Okay, so this green pepper is for the sauce part of the recipe. And I'm going to get my chicken out at the last minute. I'm really funny that way about letting chicken sit out on a hot day. Although it is fairly cool inside the house. I have the air conditioner running. But Okay, this is looking pretty good. Let me get that in my bowl. And the next thing I'm going to put in here is the pineapple with the juice. And I'm using pineapple chunks. So this was the hardest part of the recipe, was just chopping up that green pepper. So not too bad. And I'm using a 20 ounce can. So get that, and ooh, I need a bigger bowl to mix this up, otherwise I'm going to slap all over. Hold on. Yeah, that should work. Okay, uh, now the next item I'm going to add in here is the mustard, and I'm just using regular mustard. And for the mustard, two tablespoons. So I think this is kind of going to have like a little bit of a sweet and sour taste. Okay, there's the mustard. The next item I put in here is my uh, minced garlic. Okay, pineapple I have, the green pepper, the mustard, the garlic. Now I need the tamari or the soy sauce, and that is two tablespoons. I'm going to get my measuring spoon out of here. Okay. Okay. There is that. Now, I'm gonna stir this up and then get my chicken out. Good. 
You know, I have not made this recipe before, and it did not say if you were supposed to drain the pineapple, but we will find out. But I kind of think you need the juice in there. All right. Now, I will get my chicken in the crock pot, and I have 1.28 pounds. All right, looks good. That's in there, let me wash my hands. Okay, now for the chicken, I am going to sprinkle it with the black pepper, turmeric, and paprika. Okay, so I'm gonna put some black pepper in here. That's good. Uh, one teaspoon of paprika. One teaspoon of turmeric. All right, the next step. Now I'm going to pour all of this over my chicken. turn out pretty good and I think I might just serve have this with uh, you know some rice or rice aroni or something like that okay and now I am going to sprinkle a little bit of crushed red pepper over the top not too much okay now I'm going to get it in my crock pot it is going to cook for six to eight hours I will check back with you uh, you know, to see what the progress is about midway. Okay, see you in a bit. It has been approximately four hours, so let's check on this. This is the first time I have, ooh, steam. Lifted the lid. Smells good. Oh gosh, look at that. Okay, I'm gonna turn the chicken over, but doesn't that look good? Ooh, okay, there we go. That looks good. So I say maybe about another 45 minutes to an hour. Well, maybe even now. I think what I'm going to do is make some rice, white rice, and uh, just put this over the rice, but I wish you could smell it. Smell is pretty good. All right. I will be back when it is done. Okay, it is finished. I have my plate all dished up. I made some rice and uh, poured the ch or put the chicken over top. This is about half a breast here. And so I would say that this feeds about four people, maybe five, depending upon, depending upon how much chicken you know you want. But this is about half a breast I have on my plate. Okay, let's give it a try. Still pretty hot. I want to get a little bit of chicken and a little bit of rice and the pineapple. I like it. It has a good flavor. It's not too spicy. Actually, I would like it if it was a little bit sweeter, but I think it's good. I will be making it again, and I think the juices over the rice helps, uh, you know, the rice is not quite so bland, and you could always put a little more soy sauce over the top, too, but I think this is really good. I will make it again. Okay, thank you so much for watching. I want to quick mention, this coming Wednesday, I may not have a video to put up, but I will have one you know, the following Sunday, a week from today. Okay, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.